you've given your life to Jesus Christ, if you've been born again, God wants you to have full assurance of your forgiveness and His salvation. The Apostle John wrote in 1 John 5, 13, These things I have written to you who believe in the name of the Son of God, that you may know that you have eternal life. Friend, I hope you have that assurance today. If not, it's important to take a few minutes to make sure of God's forgiveness in your life. The Bible says if you confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus, if you believe in your heart that God raised Him from the dead, you will be saved. That's what Romans 10.9 says. So when you confess with your mouth, when you believe these truths, the Bible promises that you'll receive God's gift, His free gift of eternal life. You'll have a home in heaven with Him after you die. You'll also receive the covenant blessings of His peace, His presence, His power, His protection, His provision here in this life. If you've never asked Jesus to be the Lord of your life, you can pray this simple prayer right now. Dear Jesus, I need you. I confess I'm a sinner. And I confess that you are holy. I believe you are God's Son and that He raised you from the dead. Thank you for dying on the cross for me and for providing the only way for me to have a relationship with God as my Heavenly Father. Please forgive me for all my sins. Wash me clean. Come and live in my heart right now and fill me with your Holy Spirit. Thank you for rescuing me and giving me the opportunity to live in heaven with you forever. Be the Lord of my life. Teach me how to love you and walk with you every day. I pray this in your name. Amen. Friend, if you've just prayed this prayer, the Bible says you have been born again. You've been saved by God's amazing grace. And the angels in heaven right now are rejoicing over you and welcoming you to the family of God. It's important for you to spend time with God every day, talking to Him, sitting quietly, listening for the voice of His Holy Spirit to speak to you. Learn to be aware of His presence with you moment by moment. And as you grow and mature in your new faith and in your knowledge of the Bible, you're going to learn to recognize the Lord's voice speaking to you in your mind, in your heart, through the Word of God. He will bring you wonderful comfort and direction for your life as you gain a greater understanding of His Word. God bless you.